Yes! Oh, uh, we couldn't have asked for anything. Executor! Executor! Oh, sorry. Didn't see you guys there. A little bit hard being serious when you're playing somebody so silly. <laughs> but, uh, let's go ahead and I uh, hope you guys like the intro clip. But, uh, let's go ahead and uh, get into the deck profile real quick. Um, I'm going to try and make these a little bit quicker so we can just get into the gameplay. But um, yeah, so main concept of the deck is this new Alolan Executor came out on tag team. Um, 60 times the amount of executes, excuse me, that you discard in, uh, from your hand. So you can do 240 with a ditto if you evolve the ditto or if you play a lance. Lance is pretty hard, but ditto you can you can definitely do, and uh, you'll definitely see that. You got a little preview from that. Um, yeah, but um, here comes the main concept of the actual deck. Um, these actual dittos themselves. Um, this ditto really helps, so you can chain um, executes, so you can just um, bench two dittos while you're attacking with an Alona Executor. So next turn you can um, Propagation, Evolve, Evolve into Executor, Attach, Propagation, Attack. Um, so most times you're doing 210 with the Choice Man. Um, you can get the 240 off, it's not hard. Um, so yeah, playing just three of those I was playing four, but I think you really, really need three. Um, the Prism Star, huge part of the deck. Um, the Latios just helps with like Wobbuffet matchups and just a couple other matchups just to come in there and take an easy knockout. Or not easy knockout, but just to hit into something. Um, for the Propagation Eggs, of course, wouldn't want to play any other eggs. Um, doesn't work without these eggs. Um, a G hex, just because a double attachment, you can knock out wobs. Um, don't use it. <laughs> I never use it in the video. Sorry. Four of these guys, because these are my main attackers. A Mr. Mime, so we don't get wrecked by Pika. And Willard, a pseudo, so we don't get wrecked by Zork. And then these are our two main support Pokemon, and pretty much Litloose is a hero of the deck for sure. Um, three Battle Compressor because that's all we need. Um, Dazzle Machine because that's the best A spec in the deck. Um, one Energy Lotto just because we need to find the DDE. Um, two Field Blower because Garb is awful to the deck. Um, two Pokemon Communication, two Rescue Stretcher go hand in hand. Um, four Wob and Garb and Muck. Um, two Special Charge to get back our DDEs because we play three Professor Sycamore. Um, so you just want to run through the deck as fast as possible. Four Via Seeker, two Shrine um, just to help with extra numbers and you need to play a Stadium. Just because Prism Star Stadiums are really good. Um, one Coralist, just because it's the best draw supporter and expanded. One Cynthia, because we need to shuffle sometimes. Um, two Guzma, one Lance, because it can help us get out um, Elona Executor Executors and do 240. Um, 270 with a cho Choice Fan. Um, three Sycamore, like I said, just because we want to go right through the deck. Um, teammates, just because it helps us get the combo of DDE and a little uh, Executor. Um, two Choice Band, because that's really all we need. We're going to get into another one. See if we can't get a better game here now. 
I have no idea what we're gonna play. Fire, dark, psychic, colorless? Is that what I saw? One flip, which is always nice. And we get nothing. Which is great because this hand is absolute garbage. Any better? Like I said, not any better. We're just gonna let loose and see what happens. 99% of the time, what you do with the deck. We can take that. We take those. Much better. once again not a surprise <laughs> happens a lot with the deck it's okay There's nothing new about it besides maybe play um oh, what's it called <sighs> play gladian but gladian's too slow for the deck it's hard to get Lance out, I mean. So, see what we're up against. Hopefully it's something real. <laughs> Never know here on PTCGO. Oh, it's a Zora, okay, cool. All right, cool. So, going after that muck. Wherever it is. That is the thing to go down first. Goes for another setup. Here's all my six prizes. Um, I'm okay with that. Didn't go for a grimer, which is awesome. Um, I really like that. I'm gonna do that. And then, um. Let's go ahead and. Ooh! No. Oh, I got the footstone. Okay, cool. Great. So I actually got the knockout, too. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Do that. Um. Maybe the Guzma. Hmm. What else do I need? I don't need that. I don't need that more though. Great. I'm just gonna leave the sky field in play too because it's not hurting me, but it's not helping him at all. Great. Uh, Floodstone. Tree. Let's go ahead and bow the compressor again. I think it's all. I think anything else in here is kind of useful. I mean, I think they get Latios, but just in case, it might be useful. Oh um, yeah, I think just X flat. Boom. Take another turn two knockout. That's perfect. Well. 
The other egg could have been better. Benches to Lele. Immediately. Can I Guzma? Crushing Guzma, the Ditto. Oh, okay. Um, I'm actually okay with that. Ooh. chance of hitting the egg out of my prizes. Wish I had a choice man that could take out one of these shamans. Um, I think just a lele. Make it easier. Oh, whoops. Don't do that. And just I think it's just X spot, yep. Alright, four prizes on two Lele's. Terrible prizes. But it's okay. I'll take that. I guess he goes for Zorak here. Goes for another Shaman. <laughs> guess it doesn't matter. We're already down two prizes. Field Blur doesn't matter. Lele for N, I'm guessing, but the N doesn't really do much. Oh, I guess he's gonna Corliss. I don't know why you wouldn't end here, but on his own. I guess he really wants, he does really need to find his Zoroark, but another Pokemon. Uh, he's got it. Fan. Oh no, but I think that just And yep, that's it. Great. Wow. Awesome. Random stuff. <laughs> like, I don't even know. I was playing Tool Drop Sigulif. The other, the Honage Dual Blade Tool Drop. Um, I mean, granted, I 
guess I'm gonna expand it, so I am gonna play some pretty wacky stuff. But with the regionals coming up, I was expecting more people to play, be playing meta stuff. Um, my elo shouldn't be that low. I'm not entirely sure. I don't know what's up with this guy. Um, let's see. Hopefully we can get a better start. Um, I have to discard the lance. It's never good. But we gotta do it. We gotta do it. Um, especially depending on what we're playing. Um, looks like a Picarom deck. this time which is really nice um I think it ditto ditto prison star because we want to try and get out Mr. Mime wasn't a good draw of the sycamore But it's not the end of the world because next turn Next turn against Sycamore Dowsing Machine for everything. Or Dowsing Machine for the Ultra Ball. Ultra Ball for the Ball for the the guy executor there we go and then try and take a knockout hopefully he brings this thing active that would be very very nice of him I would very much like that and then I can just take a knockout and I can get revenge on uh, Pikachu Zekrom that uh, took a turn one knockout on me that I did not expect them to get but I'm okay with this guy taking a turn one knockout this guy can he can he can have one because my ditto is not sitting active <laughs> I'll give him one everybody gets one wish we had a Guzman there that would be very nice Okay. Not terrible. Not the best. Definitely could have been better. Um, definitely see him retreating now. This stuff would really help us off the draw. He's probably definitely got energy switch or something. He's got to have something. Um, I 
think I'll only play, I mean, it's going to be Marshadow unless we get something off the top deck. Oh, he doesn't knock us out, which is actually really, really good. Because hopefully now we can knock him out. We just need to... Ooh. Um... Actually, that does it. Because I can Battle Compressor. And then... Propagation. And then... Propagation. And then... Ultra Ball. And I can actually put the buff padding on him. So... Oh. Whoa. I almost totally screwed that up. Um, yeah, I think, yeah, this is great. That was a great Cynthia. Thank you, Cynthia. Cynthia! Call it to Cynthia. Um, Dowsing Machine for the Battle Compressor. Egg, I think, what, a Guzma, maybe a teammate in case he takes a knockout. And then we're gonna evolve, we're gonna play the energy, play the buff padding, play energy lotto for nothing. And then we're gonna propagate. This guy's probably like, what the heck? This guy's taking a knockout to on a tag team GX turn two? Yeah, I'm taking a knockout on a tag team GX. A turn a two, a sir. Yes, a sir. Because, you know who the boy is. You already know, expert, executor. Yes! Oh, we couldn't have asked for anything more. Oh, that Cynthia was great. Oh, let's go. Let's go. I think that's just game. Um, I don't know. Yep, that's just game. <laughs> we just beat BDIF turn two. Just saying. <laughs> it's pretty good. That was pretty good. All right. That, that was that was awesome. All right. Let's try to get into one more. One more. Let's get a good one. Maybe not a Hitmon Chan deck, or I didn't see what it was. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. <gasps> Tail <Terrible> start. <gasps> Ultra Ball Guzma GX. <gasps> and then prize an egg, which is good. Sort of shine, just marsh shadow. <gasps> Hope we get something. <coughs> um, not completely terrible. <gasps> can we marsh shadow next turn? We can. I'm actually just gonna go ahead and marsh shadow right now. Because I want to get set up more and play another, another supporter, or play a supporter, I should say. I'm 
not terrible. Not the best, not who we wanted. Not what we wanted, per se. So we'll see what my opponent's playing. We hope you can binge a bunch of stuff. So we can actually get some cards off this Corliss. See what he's playing. Oh, okay. Oh, it's very confident putting up that Lele. All right, let's see if hopefully we can knock that Lele out. energy that's nice got the knockout I don't know why you promoted the Lele um, yeah that was just a very greedy play by my opponent and we're gonna punish him for it I always forget that you gotta hit the transform first. And then the cool animation is kinda, that's pretty cool. Um, we're actually gonna Pokecom. Oh, Ditto Prism Prize. I guess I could have just kept a pseudo if that was the case. But, once again, another turn two knockout, and there's the dough. And I don't see my opponent knocking us out. It's a cute idea. I wonder if he plays DCE too. Hmm. I wonder. I wonder. Under the sea. Under the sea. Ooh, he's gonna hit me for 10. Oh, he almost paralyzed me. Um, I think we're just gonna do this. Yeah. Why not? Just draw through our deck. No reason not to. Teammates next turn if he takes a knockout. Or Guzma. <coughs> um, I guess technically speaking we can take the knockout with Guzma next turn.
Alrighty. <coughs> awesome. Yeah, we the shrine, which is okay because it did its job. Um. Two. Set two thirty, so we can just take a clean knockout. We know we need a choice man. So, yeah, just went in four turns. Three turns? Four turns. Yeah, four turns. It's okay. Yeah, pretty good. Take that. Um, so we just need dragon energy, pretty much. Um, just for the sake of it. Really glad he didn't leave. Thank you, opponent. Oh, I have to say that. <laughs> I wanted to see him take that big old knockout. Well, oh, oh, where am I? Oh, where am I? Well, I guess I'm in space, guys. But anyways, don't forget to check out my other videos up here and up here. And uh, like and subscribe down below. Don't forget to comment. Thanks for watching, guys.